Everything got 40, man. Y'all just short as I'm going all off the head with the shout outs today, if y'all can't tell. Bam Music, um, Dave Mack, we got to shout them out for their uh, new podcast, Tuned In. They always give me a great question. I forgot the question. I, uh, um, it was a great. Oh, I remember this now. Or I remember that, now. Or... I remember now. It was, um, so some, some lady was wilding at dinner and made the dude um, pay for the kids. I remember he showed up. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah so yeah, like, yeah. if you show up late, are you gonna buy my kids food for wasting my time? Type shit. How much do you make per hour? <laughs> right. How much do you make per hour? Because steak and uh, potatoes. That's like a forty dollar meal. You know. What right. I mean? If if you making twenty five dollars an hour, well, why I gotta buy two why steak and potatoes for your two kids? I didn't you know, make them kids. I didn't make them kids, <laughs> and you don't make that per hour. Facts, bro. <laughs> I didn't waste that much of your time. Yeah. You know? Yeah, for real. Yeah. No, for so, real. So, you know what I'm saying? If we going hmm. by your time, how much is your time worth? Right, not worth Shit, the average job paying about, what, 18 19 an hour? Hopefully. So well, you, yeah, you can get hired at McDonald's flipping burgers for 17 Yeah, so you got about $35 you got about, you got about to work with. You got about $35 to work with, and that don't cover two steaks. I'm sorry. Mm. Yeah, not anymore. Mm-mm, mm-mm. No, not, you got your, not maybe uh, ever. I do. I do the one steak and potatoes with a kids meal. Mm. Oh, okay. I got y'all. Then y'all actually, yeah, I was thinking about like one steak and potatoes, but two sides. They share that steak. Yeah, y'all split the steak. Boom. Yeah. Well, then we go. Yeah. Then we go. Right. That's See, not it's bad. compromise. We can reach a compromise. Why am I buying nice. food to go on a date though? Well, because she asked. <laughs> Well, see, <laughs> it's gonna be cold, bro. If I, we're going back to my house or hers, yeah. Well, see, she asking you to buy food for the kids because you wasted her time, quote unquote. But I've been with yeah. women of, of of that nature before, and usually they just want they. If I'm eating good, I want my kids to eat good too. Yeah, you know that's mean? real. Now, yeah, that's fair. what I've seen in that scenario is a woman will ask me to buy the food for the child, and she'll mm. be like, "If you don't want to, it's fine. I'll just buy it." Or she'll just order the food to go and order it on a separate ticket. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? And then yeah. I'll be the dude that I am and be like, no, nah, don't worry about that. Yeah, I'll get the second one. ticket. It's whatever. You know what I'm like, I don't know why she even did that, making it seem like I'm broke. But whatever. I haven't dated that many uh, girls with kids, I guess. See, uh, <laughs> the way society is set up for me now. <laughs> uh, That's all there is. No, nah, no, nah, just being a straight man, like, it's a lot better just knowing that. You know, your your body parts down there is mm. the body parts that is down there. Right. So I would like to see, yeah, oh, she got a child. Cool. Cool. At least I know that's a real girl. You know yeah, I mean? that's fair. That's a- <laughs> <laughs> At least she fucks. <laughs> I know two things Mostly about joking. you right off the top. <laughs> I know you fucking, and I know you never been a boy. <laughs> hey. Oh, look, shit. We can talk. And I know you reckless. <laughs> <laughs> I know, bro. Decision making, probably a six out of ten. That's all right. We can work with it. <laughs> Your decision making is trash. I saw you, baby daddy. He is ass, yo. He got shit on me. Like, the nerve you even curved me a oh little bit. God. For real, that's funny. Now, is steak and potatoes too much? Are y'all thinking like at that moment, like why is she not ordering something else for the kids, and why is she just going straight to the steak and potatoes? Because she could mix it up a little bit. Mm. You feel me? Like, I don't know. Because I'm just thinking about it, it ain't wrong to like, you know, help, you know, feed or whatever. But does it have to be a steak of potatoes? Right. You know Could I mean? it be a chicken tender fucking meal? You I'm know, get six tenders and fries. and cheese, bro. Yeah. Something I know Some they're going to eat. You know what I'm saying? Because she, she's eating that second steak. And, <laughs> in, 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 interest, in the interest. And that's all right. In the interest of But just ask me for a second steak. Yay. You know, don't tell me you want it for the kids. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to be upset. Why That's me you assuming be, why a lot. Why would you be upset by doing something nice for some No, children? it's not even that, but it's like, tell me what you want instead of saying the kids want. And like, is this the first date? Yay. <laughs> you feel me? I believe it was the day first date. Okay. That's a lot on a first date. That bro. is kind of I like, spend extra, <laughs> I spend extra on my first dates. Dude, you were asking me about this. Okay. what? Yeah. How mm-hmm. much do you spend on a date? Me personally? Yeah. Like, what's your- I'm prepared for 250 Ooh. Okay. I'm too well, that's smart. Yeah. I'm well, listen. Well, listen. Listen. Probably around there. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this. Just in case she pulls some bullshit like that, <laughs> yeah. I'm prepared for about four hundred dollars on a date. Fuck no. I plan to spend two hundred. 
Yeah. So as long as you don't exceed, like right, you don't start you know ordering saying? Dom to the table or something. Yeah, it's, but like, it's like I ain't. <laughs> like, I'm not trying to like order that. a personal <laughs> singer for you. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't doing all that, but like yeah, get you some nice drinks, get you some nice food, have a good time, and don't yeah. feel pressure. Yeah. About okay. you know what I'm saying about the menu. You know what I'm saying? If I brought you to this place, I brought us here to have a good time. And right. I ain't Order no what cheap. you want. Yeah, You know exactly. what I'm saying? Get yeah. what you finna Have a do. good time. Now, if you come out and get the $150 steak, I'm going to look at you away. But, you know, I came prepared to spend this $400. I mean, it's in the budget. <laughs> it's there. I'm not going to be happy about it, but it's there. Go ahead. Do your thing. Right. So, uh, so I was just about to ask you. So, like, if she starts to get, you know, to get, you know, you know, we out here. We all right. Let's say okay. You know what? To start off, because you know, I think everybody wants to eat before they get the night going. You spend one hundred and fifty, right? Mm-hmm. Now her plate alone is just you know a little pricey, right? And you know you, you know you like to eat, so you might get you some you know pretty good as well. Are you thinking like? Are you just letting it go? Because I know, man, like, I don't know. Yeah. I've never been a type to, like, care if it's somebody that I, you know, like, if it's first date and I'm vibing with you, I'm really not caring. But if I'm like, mm, I don't know. Because you, cause you're thinking about, you know, like, your time, you know, what you're spending. Are you like that? Or are you just going to go with it? You just like It depends. Like, so... It depends for me because like nowadays you get the vibe of women be trying to use you mm. just for like the free food. So like if we having a good like a legitimate good time, I'm really like penetrating your mind a little bit. Like you really starting to respond to what I got going on. I don't have a problem with you spending with whatever the fuck you want to spend. Like go ahead, you know what I'm saying? <coughs> um because we having a good time. Yeah. You know right. what I'm saying? Um, but if I get the vibe that you like, you just using me. You out on you out on this date because you thought I was gonna take you somewhere nice, blah blah blah, and you know you got these different type of expectations. Then nah, like I'm not gonna be happy about it. Okay, like I have to be happy. You have to make me happy about spending the money. So if you're enjoying the right. time, it's nothing. You know, it's nothing to have. You know, like a a good night. You know, like you know, spend you, you know, a couple hundred. And this is the experience. You had a good time. Yeah. Hopefully, you know, another day. Comes you got out that night in your memory forever with it. Exactly. Them. Okay. Now, see, now, if we go out and I get the vibe that you're just trying to use me the whole night, I might still go ahead and pay, you know, <laughs> a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I might pay a certain dollar amount <laughs> for that. Yeah. But only because I think I'm trying to fuck, but I never speak to you again. But if she bringing her fucking best friend. And they both trying to eat, and they open up the tab, bro. And we start shooting tequila. <laughs> it's a red flag. I don't know, man. That might be a green light. You talking about a red flag? That might be the green light for me. We got go, go, go. Is, is me, you, and your friend, and we all taking tequila shots? That sounds like six hundred to me. That sounds like a, <laughs> like a threesome to me. <laughs> hey, I'm paying lie. for your best friend. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. That like that first half hour is probably like a good 60, 80 spent on some drinks. Cause you gotta think about how like the bro. vibes is good. I know me and Don, bro, when when we done went out in beer hall, motherfucking yeah. Gmail man. Hey, we come back, we look at our accounts, man. I didn't spend about 60, 50. That's a low night. I go 80, 120 when I'm out alone. Too. Well, it's like, yeah, bro. Them drinks are cr- fucking crazy. Well, see, the drinks, crazy. the drinks for me ain't so bad. I don't drink heavy. I usually only drink one, maybe two. Mm. So, like, that already cheapens the night for me. And right. then knowing the women that I know, most girls can't drink that much. They are cool four <laughs> to five shots, and then it's yeah. over with, bro. They're yeah. soft. You know what I mean? Yeah. So it's just like. Nah, man, go ahead. Get y'all a little drinks, man. That shit ain't gonna cost me that much. What, fifteen dollars a drink? I'm buying what twelve? Yeah, drinks? maybe twelve Ooh. times fifteen. Damn, I don't twelve know, times twelve player. is one hundred forty-four. That's so it's over that. <laughs> it's one ninety-six. <laughs> but you said like about like amongst how many people though? It's three of us. I twelve. Three of us? Oh, it's only three. Okay, that's not bad. That's not three of y'all yeah, having four three. drinks. That's not bad at that's all. Still twelve drinks. But no, but, <laughs> but it's twelve across the board. It's not like. You feel me? It's not like okay, we got like hella people on on drinks. There's three people and y'all having a great night. I yeah, can like, yeah. you know what I mean. Yeah, if that's what we doing. Bougie motherfuckers. That's what that is. Right? <laughs> Man, us? Yes, you. <laughs> me? Yes. <laughs> Mate, I mean, yeah. 
I'll accept that. Yes. <laughs> I mean, if I'm gonna, dr- I gotta drink a yeah. high noon. I'm. Not- <laughs> I I see. I could get the j- same job done because yeah. I hear you with like two or three dollar PBR tall boys. You drink about twelve of them bitches together, <laughs> and mm. it's going down. I don't- <laughs> I don't like them shits, though. Uh-uh. That's not the point. The <laughs> point is to get drunk. <laughs> and that's efficient. <laughs> Damn. I don't know, man. I, I got to have something that, that's cool, man. Otherwise, it's not going to be a good night. I done had some folks buy me some shots, and I'm like, nah, okay. You're done, though. Yeah. Yeah, man. And, and I think that's like a red flag at first, because like, if, if we drinking... And you on some type of like you don't drink certain shit and somebody just pass you some. Right. I don't know. Well, I learned long ago you can't mix that shit, bro. Yeah, I'm like nah, the clears and that. darks, and nah. I can't go like once I'm off beer and like from wine, I'm going like you can't go back. Bro, I'm one way. I'm yeah. one way. If it's dark, we dark. If it's yeah. if it's light, we light. Goddamn. Really, don't even change the brand. If it's Hennessy, we if drink, we drink it. Hennessy, yeah. <laughs> we drink. You wanna feel fancy for that first shot? Welcome yeah. to five more. Listen to me, bro. <laughs> And that's just me. I don't know. I do like, but I guess six to seven drinks when I'm out. That's like, a good amount. You probably would. six cocktails and then a beer or two. What's a cocktail? Define cocktail. For Anything that the with one like with the liquor glass? in it. I think at least an ounce of liquor in it. That's what them bitches be telling me in the back mm-hmm. seat of the Ubers. They be like, I just had two cocktails. And I be thinking they had the little they cocktail had, glass. <laughs> they had like two shots. Oh. That is. It's that's a mega a, cocktail. That's though. a drink of death. That's yeah, a, a mixed drink. That's action. what it is. There we go. Yeah. I seen some shit called a Long Beach iced tea the other day. That's like oh, the same shit, shit with just a different juice. It. Yeah, it's the it's same different shit, juice. different juice. Um, four, the four. Everything behind the cabinet and mm-hmm. then <laughs> apple juice instead. <laughs> oh, the adios, motherfucker. Uh, adios, yeah. Motherfucker. They be making them shits too strong. Yeah. They make yeah. them shits too strong. So, like, yeah, there's no mixer, basically. They mix it with the blue Syracow, and that's still got like 9 or 10% of alcohol in it. So oh, that's the juice. Bro, that's why it's fucked that off. That shit powerful, bro. <laughs> I don't like yeah. that shit, yo. I done had some shit like that. I wasn't that strong. The last time I had it was probably like when we went to New York. Temple. Uh, yeah. 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 He was pulling some strong. Bro, yeah, yeah. He was, yeah, he that was nigga, about it. That nigga at Temple was doing his motherfucking thing, bro. He was trying to put y'all out. Was he right. heavy handed? Huh? Was he heavy handed? Bro, bro, yeah, bro. There's something wrong with him. Y'all, he was pouring too much alcohol in my shit, bro. <laughs> were you watching him too? Were yeah, you? I was looking oh, at him, bro. I'm sitting yeah. there talking to him. <laughs> nigga, overfits too much. He was probably just blessing you, though, for real. Bro, now you don't bless me that <laughs> right. way. Right. Don't bless me that way. Take some of that alcohol out my cup, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, like, can I get some ice cubes or something? Yeah, bro, give me some water, bro. <laughs> let's, let's douse this shit down just a tad bit. You feel me? Right. Oh. oh, wow. Yeah, those are gnarly drinks, wow, bro. I had those for the first time up in uh, Fort Collins when I was like in college. The I didn't adios. go to FOCO, but partied up there a bunch. Yeah, the adios, bro. It was like, fuck. Some crazy nights. Did you all ever make like jungle juices and shit yeah. for your house parties and for like Dude, in school? I, I never made it, right. but I part- I had some jungle juice and like, man, shit's dangerous too. I ain't gonna lie to you. I swear. When I was in private school, shit. in high school, as a matter of fact, we had a jungle juice party. Woo. Not epic. It was not epic. How many were y'all there? <laughs> it was like, not epic. Like how many people? It was probably only 12 of us there, bro. It wasn't even. That's not enough was, people for jungle yeah. juice. It was Was not, there a lot left over? Like, <laughs> it was not enough high schoolers for jungle juice yeah. to be made in that motherfucker. Was there a lot and left was, over though? Huh? Was there a lot left over? <laughs> yeah, we put it, they had it in the Gatorade thing because they thought it was going to yeah. be a lot of people coming to it. Damn. And it wasn't nothing but 12, maybe 15 people throughout the whole Everybody while. survived? <laughs> we made it. We made it. Barely, though, bro. Like, I passed out early. You know me. I told you I'm a lightweight. Oh, yeah. That's when it comes to alcohol, bro, it's over with me. I got about three, four shots in me, and then I'm out of there. Yeah. <laughs> Five or six. You start talking about jungle juice and all that other shit, bro. I ain't even drinking high school. Right, bro. with pure grade alcohol. <laughs> yeah, bro. Like, y'all, y'all throwing Fuck. Everclear in the juice? Yeah. What's wrong with you? Oh, man? bro. Shit. What that, y'all mix y'all jungle juice with? Um, Everclear. You sick bad. <laughs> yeah, Everclear you and sick Gatorade. Bastard. I'm not going to lie, man. Kool-Aid packs? I'm not that experienced. Look, I, he, ne- I never mix my own. <laughs> I never mix my own. Like, but I seen, I seen some people go crazy. <laughs> Everclear tequila, wine, punch, and sliced fruit. Oh, there my you go. Lord. That's You know what? But if you take that light, though, it probably tastes good, though. No, nigga. No, nigga. You it don't taste not, 
No, it, it tastes, tastes like delicious. candy. Okay. Yeah. It tastes delicious. Don't think oh, it's, it's bad, bro. It tastes delicious. Yeah. And you're going to have three, four, five cups, and you're going to die, bro. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> you're going to die. Dehydration. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro. Bro, when that the whole Fuck. pill era started, <laughs> bro, niggas was throwing the Xanax in the jungle juice, and I'm Hell like, "Hell no! What, what are y'all doing, bro? This we don't have to do that." Uh, obviously, they did. We right. don't have to do that. If we're trying to, to unplug, place, bro. Though, they're trying okay. to die. Bro. That's crazy. They're trying to commit the funnest suicide of all time. I seen that at a concert though. They're crushing down Xannies into blunts. Mm. You gotta, you gotta make sure he's grabbing blunts from and shit. It was fucking weird. Yeah, that's why I don't smoke with y'all niggas no more. Uh,